you guys, it's Christina. The holidays are just around the corner and I'm so excited because I love the holiday season. I love being able to bring people into my home and I love being able to share with them my Fully Raw lifestyle. I love being able to share with all of you my Fully Raw lifestyle. I love being able to make people delicious food that wins the way to their heart through their bellies. Now don't get scared on me. I know what you may be thinking. Holiday seasons mean that you have to go to a bunch of different social events and you may have to bring a dish with you. Well, I will tell you this. I love the holiday seasons because it's a way for me to share my fully raw lifestyle with everyone around me that I love. This can be a great opportunity for you to do the same as well. So today, we are gonna be making a fully raw, potato-less holiday salad that you can bring with you to any social event. We are gonna turn all of those skeptics into believers and we are gonna win the way to their hearts with this delicious salad. So, we're gonna make a dish that you can bring with you, that you can feel comfortable eating, and that you can share with family and friends as well. Are you ready? Let's make this awesome holiday salad because it is crunchy, it is delicious, it is sweet, and it's fully raw, and it's so good for you. <laughs> Here are the ingredients that you're gonna need. For the salad, you will need two large cauliflowers, two to three small cucumbers, one head of sparkling celery, green onions, cha 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 chives, a few radishes, and those can be optional if you don't want your salad to be spicy, a half of one red onion, one jicama, which will be finely chopped and peeled, three bell peppers, colorful if you can, they tend to brighten up your salad and make it super rainbow bright, and just because I'm me, Cherry tomatoes! For your creamy potato-less salad dressing, you will also be using two to three zucchinis, one to two avocados, not even a quarter of a cup of pine nuts, freshly squeezed lemons, fresh dill, a touch of cumin, and one garlic clove, which will be optional for you. So the first step in making the cauliflower salad is that we need to take our cauliflower and we're gonna grind a part of it up into the food processor. So I have two cauliflowers here. I'm gonna take one and I'm gonna put it through the processor so that I'm gonna chop it into pieces, into little blocks. And then I'm gonna take them and I'm gonna put them into the food processor so that it becomes almost like a grainy, um, very smooth, almost a creamy, potato-y type of texture. For the other cauliflower, we're gonna chop it up very, very finely as to give it more of a chunky texture. That way we can have two different types of potato-less type of textures in the salad. And when you're done, you're gonna take all of your cauliflower bits and you're gonna put them in your bowl as a base so that we can start putting in all of the rest of our chopped items in there. Pretty, look at how pretty that is. It's almost like white snow. So now that we've put the cauliflower in the bowl, we're gonna take all of the rest of our salad ingredients and we're gonna chop them as finely as we can and then we're gonna layer them on top so that we can mix them all together and create our salad. The secret to this dish is chopping everything as small as you possibly can. That is what will make it finely crunchy and super, super sweet. So, let's get started. And just keep in mind that any ingredient that you don't want in the salad, you don't have to put in. Anything and everything is optional to make it the perfect potato-less holiday salad for you and your family and friends. And next, I'm gonna combine my chives and my dill together and I'm just gonna finely mince them until they are just absolutely so tiny that I can just add them into the salad. 
So your average potato salad does not have tomatoes in it, but I will say, I add cherry tomatoes to everything and the cherry tomatoes give it that beautiful kick. You have to add cherry tomatoes if you want this to be super juicy and delicious. You don't have to, but I'm just saying, you should. Now you cannot tell me that this is not one gorgeous looking bowl. Are you ready to get your hands in there and get a little dirty? It's time to mix it together. So as if this salad didn't look epic enough, no. We're still gonna add the dressing. That's right, because everything I make in my kitchen is epic. Do you hear me? This is not done yet. You technically could eat it just like this. You could just take your face and just, you know, stick it in there. But we're gonna make our zucchini dill creamy avocado pine nut lemon dressing. So when you're ready for the dressing, we're gonna take our zucchinis and we're gonna chop them up and we're gonna put them into our dressing with our dill, our one clove of garlic, our pinch of cumin, the juice of two to three lemons, less than a quarter of a cup of pine nuts, and one avocado. If you want it to be more fatty or more creamy, you could add in another avocado. It's time for the dressing. Go. Are you ready for creamy, creamy green perfection? Oh, <laughs> yum. Look, look, it's perfect. It's perfect, it's so perfect. And when you're ready for the final touch of adding the dressing, you're simply gonna pour in your creamy dressing on top, and then we're gonna mix it in with our hands. Christina didn't anticipate making this much, so maybe you may wanna pick a bigger bowl. I wasn't planning on making this much, I'm just saying. All right, you guys, that's it. Can you see this gorgeous deliciousness? Are you looking at this? Are you looking at this massive, epic, fully raw holiday salad? <laughs> heck yes you are. If you're saying heck yes right now, and if you're excited to eat this and bring it with you to holiday party, I think you should give it a thumbs up. Heck yes. I'm gonna go eat this right now. I think I could eat this whole thing myself. Maybe, just maybe. <laughs> I hope you guys love this recipe and I hope it wins the way to your heart and the hearts to everyone that you love so that you can share this amazing lifestyle with them as well. If you're looking for more great recipes or tips and tricks on how to go fully raw, please subscribe to my channel at Fully Raw Christina as I try and inspire you to get healthy and to share this lifestyle and make a healthier planet for everybody, especially during the holiday season because the holidays are meant to be happy and not sad. If you guys need more daily inspiration, you can also follow me on my Facebook page at Fully Raw Christina as I love to post daily pictures of what I'm eating and of little things that inspire me and that keep me happy and smiling throughout the day. All the produce in this video comes from my local organic produce cooperative here in Houston called Rawfully Organic, which I volunteer at weekly and I love to death. You guys can check that out at rawfullyorganic.com. All right, you guys, it's time to Get in my belly. I'm gonna go eat my epic salad. And I hope that you get to do the same as well. Sending you my love and my kisses. Hugs. You want some? You wanna try my holiday salad, Miss Zoe? Let's see. You wanna try some? <laughs> see, even Miss Zoe likes it. <laughs> You can win the way to everybody's hearts with this salad. <laughs> now, I think that that deserves a thumbs up. <laughs> this is my sexy holiday look. Can I serve you dinner, senor? <laughs>